Africa is a vast and diverse continent that has been home to human communities for thousands of years. The history of Africa is long and complex and it has been shaped by a wide range of factors including geography, climate, migration, trade, colonialism and even traditional dances. Join me in this video so that we can be able to understand the beauty of African continent, the indigenous cultures found within the continent and how the lifestyle looks like in Africa. Before we start, please take one second to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Africa stands out in many instances since it is believed most of the things which were discovered in Africa are being practiced both within the continent and across the world. In west of Africa, we have different cultural dances and one of them is the Kumbo dance. Kumbo dance is a traditional dance of the Diora or Jora people who live in Gambia and parts of the neighboring countries. The dance is performed by a group of men and women who wear elaborate masks and costumes and move in a rhythmic, synchronized manner to the beats of the drums. The dance is believed to have originated as a ritual dance to honor the spirits of the ancestors and is still performed on special occasions such as weddings, funerals and other important events. The dancers use a variety of movements, including jumping, stick spinning, and shaking, to express a range of emotions and tell stories through their dance. Kumbo dance is an important part of Dura culture, and it has been passed down from generation to generation. In recent years, the dance has gained wider recognition outside of Gambia, and it is now performed in festivals and other cultural events around the world. With the current generation performing combo dance in countries such as Senegal, Ghana, Gambia, and Guinea, there is a bit of confusion of where exactly the dance originated from. There are those who believe that this traditional dance was first held in the village of Kanuma, Gambia, and was held by the Diora or Jora people. On the other hand, the Baga people of Guinea believe they are the originators of the dance. In our in-depth research, we believe Kumbo dance originated from Gambia of the Diora people and got several advancements in Guinea, Ghana, and Senegal. There is always a question of who participates in the Kumbo dance. The traditions of the dance allow the Same to invite the people of the village to participate with the festivity. The Kumbo is dressed with a palm leaves and wears a stick on the head. At the start of the dance, a young lady beats a colored flag on the stick. She dances for hours with the stick and the flag on the head. She then can be joined by several other kumbos. People always believe that the dancers who participate are not by themselves, but are possessed by the spirits. This has always been the trend when the dance is performed. People who attend the dance are not supposed to look directly at the kumbo palm leaves as the kumbo protects themselves from intruders by the use of their stick by a single smash and pointing towards them. The Dura people regard this dance highly as it connects them to the ancestral spills and the environment. UNESCO has come out to recognize this dance, making it more admirable by people across Africa and even motivating those who carry out the dance to take it more seriously during performance whenever it is requested. For any traditional dance that is performed, it must have a conclusion. For Kumbo dance, it varies depending on the specific cultural context and the particular performance. In some instances, the dance may end with a traumatic flourish such as a final acrobatic maneuver or a climactic drum beat. <laughs> In other cases, the dancers may gradually wind down the tempo of the dance until it comes to a peaceful and meditative conclusion. Regardless of the specific form that the conclusion takes, Kumbo dance is typically seen as a celebration of life, community, and cultural heritage. Through its rhythmic movements and energetic performances, the dance brings together people from different backgrounds and helps to strengthen the bonds of social cohesion and cultural identity. The West of Africa is rich of cultural dances which are more entertaining and are not comparable to the East and South Africa. Dances like Gaori Tama dance, 
Zauri dance and Boroya dance all originate from the west of Africa. But the reality is, the Kumbo dance is the most highly regarded dance in the west, and I welcome you to visit Gambia to enjoy the dance. Thank you for watching this video, and kindly remember to subscribe, like, and share. Thank you.